Now for a special way to help others for the holidays. If you plan to be out shopping this weekend, you might add an extra toy to the list. This is the seventh year for the Super Chris Toy Drive, which has given away nearly 11,000 toys to local children who would otherwise receive nothing for the holiday. Chris Sanders is the man with the vision. Thanks for being here. So this started off with like 50 toys and now seven years later here we are uh, i woke up and i thought i, I want to give away 50 toys and if i don't tell anybody and i fail no one knows oh. but once i say it out loud i have to do it so 50 turned into 100 for the first year and 200 the next and then 400 and then it just took off from there so that's awesome yeah. and you obviously had the community support the rally behind those goals I, they hear it and they're like we want to help us. I, I will say that my friends and family uh, really do I put it on Facebook and Instagram and uh, the fact that every that people really trust me and allow me to spend their money or collect their toys is really nice um, amazing places like for instance grow up house uh, they allow me to put a toy box in there places around the city one point room place different restaurants just different people allowed me to use their area and then IUPUI allowed me to collect a basketball game so it was building trust and working with the community that made it easier for me it, it seems like a no-brainer but how can how can we get involved I imagine getting toys is one thing but I you probably could use cash too huh yes uh, actually the last day for me to collect cash uh, was Wednesday, okay. but tomorrow is a really big day. IUPUI plays at noon. If you bring a toy, you get a free ticket to the game. Oh, easy. Yeah, so that's that's really easy. So any toy, you get a free ticket to the game. And then Sunday is the giveaway, and so the giveaway will be, and that's the bigger part. Mm -hmm. For those who are in need, please come out to 2250 Ralston. It's Kip Legacy High School, and you can get toys there. Um, and the toys are great. People donate great things. Uh, every year, a guy I donates two laptops. I give those to kids who are on the honor roll. Uh -huh. uh, bikes, toy. I take my son with me when I buy the toys, and I tell him to get things he would want or things his friends would want. So the gifts are pretty nice. So get there early because the great toys will be there early. So 12 to 3 on Sunday is the day to pick up. But tomorrow, if you want to donate, and there's actually still a box at Grub House um, until tomorrow, probably around noon. So the best way would probably be the IUPUI game. Great. You say you woke up one day and had mm -hmm. this idea, but what? where did the inspiration <clears throat> really come from? Was there a moment where you... And met a child that didn't have a Christmas. Mm -hmm. You know what? Happened? Well, I love Christmas. This is my favorite time of the year to start with. But I went to high school with a girl, and she uh, was in an abusive relationship. Mm -hmm. And she once told me that when she got the confidence and courage to leave, she had her son in one hand and her purse in the other. Mm -hmm. So that uh, inspired me because if you finally do get the courage to leave, the last thing you should be worried about if I need to stay there longer to make sure my kid has a good Christmas or something like that. So I want to help to remove that for that year. I know that there's a big hurdle that they have to cross, but I don't want that to be the issue. So again, and I like for, and again, I started off with the Ruth Lilly Women and Children's Center, which I still, that's the number one place I give the toys to because it was important that I help. I come from a single mom and I wanted to help single moms. So um, I decided to help the shelter. So the toys started going there for the first four years and I expanded to, the, I grew up off of 25th and Keystone. So I wanted to help the neighborhood that I come from. So it just got bigger and bigger, but it started with a conversation with the friends. Fantastic. Chris, thanks for doing what you do. Thank you. I can understand why it's called Super Chris. Absolutely. Super <laughs> Chris. Yeah. So we have that information again on those on the screen right now where you can donate and again go to that IUPUI game I think that sounds fantastic I would love for everybody yeah. to show, and there's a challenge going on between the men and the women for IUPUI to see which team the men's oh, basketball team or the women so tomorrow's the last day put a competition to 